What's going on YouTube? My name is Will Young from Drip Talk. Guys, this video is sponsored by Drip Talk Jewelry. Today we will be going over this Gen 5 watch right here. Uh, there is some things that I need to put out there to the world about it. And at the same time, I've been getting a lot of requests for a, peop for a lot of people wanting to see this watch and give my personal opinion on it. Um, let's go ahead on and get ready to get down to it. Guys, we're getting close to 9K. I don't know if it's going to be this video or the next one. So at the end of this, watch to the end. Guys, let me know what you put Drip Soldier in the comment section. Let me know what smaller giveaway you want. And let me know what bigger giveaway that you want, guys. So I'm expecting two giveaways from everybody. Big one and a small one. And I'll let y'all know what separates each one, what will be in each one. So y'all y'all keep y'all ears open for that. Like this video, share it, uh, you know, do everything you got to do. But, you know, like I say, this video is sponsored by Drip Talk Jewelry. Y'all go over to the website, check it out, guys. Okay, it feel kind of weird just, you know, going over my product. Um, you know, I... But there's a few details that I need to put out about these watches, guys. Let me let you guys know that Drip Talk Jewelry, every watch that you get will come with a box just like this, guys. All right. As you open up the box, we always going to send something, a wristband, letting you guys know. Like, if you could pass this out to a friend or something, you know what I'm saying? Whenever you pass it out to a friend, they'll be able to check out the YouTube channel or whatever else from there, guys. And the other thing that comes out with every watch will be your own link removal. All right. Now let's get down to the watch. A lot of requests about this watch. Guys, honestly, if you are going to make this thing a everyday watch... A few details that you have to pay attention to in this video. Okay, this is a mechanical watch. Once you set the time on this thing, once you set the time, the time is on the side right here on the dial. I'm going to show y'all how iced out it is, but this is the most important thing about this watch. You're going to take the little chuck on the side. You're going to take that. You're going to pull that out. Let me show y'all. See if I can show you. Y'all see that white chuck right there? Take that. You're going to pull that out. It came out, guys. All right. You're going to take the stem on the side. You're going to pull it all the way out. Once you pull it all the way out, as you can tell right now, guys, this thing isn't ticking at all. It's not ticking. And once you set it, I don't know exactly what time it is. It's, we're just going to... But we're going to take this. We're going to take the side. We're going to push it all the way in. Once you put it, push it all the way in, it's still not ready, guys. You're going to take this stem and you're going to wind it up. You can actually hear it winding as you're, as you're turning it. Wind it. And once you wind that thing, there you go, guys. Y'all can see it's ticking now. And take a look. It's a little dim and dark in here. You can see the hands actually glow in the dark. But this thing is ticking and it is spinning now. She moving. And with this particular watch, this isn't just a regular, like a regular tick. This thing's swift. It got the it got the sweeping feature on this thing, guys. But if you set this thing down for X amount of hours, this is not ran by a battery, guys. So this thing will eventually stop. So you got to make sure you wind this thing up enough, wind it up, wind it up, and it will last for at least 24 to 48 hours. But as you, if you go, if you're going to use it as an everyday watch, before you go to sleep, wind it up the way to be ready for you in the morning, wind it up. This is not ran by a battery, so it does not tick. You got to, you got to wind this thing up to keep it moving. If you don't keep winding it up. It will not move. I had somebody send one of these back to me because they thought they thought that it didn't work right. That's just the way this mechanical watch worked, man. He sent it back. 
Uh, he, you know, he he didn't want no refund or anything. He wanted a different watch. So I'm like, man, let me check. Let me let me do some more details on my watches and stuff. Uh, cause I didn't know enough about a mechanical watch. But 100%, I know everything that I need to know about it now. And that's just the, the feature. Everybody that get one of these watches, I've been reaching out to them on Instagram and letting them know how to work this. But I'd say the best way to do this is put it out in a video so everybody can see at one time. But that's how you that's how you, you set the watch. You wind it up to keep it going for a period of time. You got to keep it wind up if it's going to be an everyday watch. Something like this. I wouldn't wear it every day, me personally. I'm not going to work with this on. I'm not doing it. But uh, this would be like a weekend thing for me. So I would keep it in, stored in my box personally. And when I got it in the box, when I needed the next weekend, I just set the time on it and just crank it up, guys. But we do have three different tones with this watch, guys. Same thing. Uh, this is the actual gold one. Let me give y'all some details on this watch. As y'all can see, if you look around the bezel, it's iced out. It's iced out on the top. It's iced out on the sides. Every angle that light actually hits this watch, it's going to shine. They even got stones on the side of the bands, guys. We got stones everywhere on this thing. This is a CZ watch, guys. Um, since we diamond test everybody else stuff, I've never put this on a diamond tester, guys. I, you know, I know what it is, but, you know, we're doing this for the people that like to see the diamond tester put on. Uh, let me open this up so you guys can take a look at the back. Y'all see back there how the, how the, all your parts back there are moving? Once you wind that thing up and this thing go to ticking, you can see back there clearly how this thing works. So that's a pretty nice feature on this thing. Okay. Let's see, Diamond Tester is warmed up. We're going to put this thing on four, guys. I'm going to show y'all the other two different different colors that we have, the other two different tones that we have. Okay, nothing, guys. As we already know, for CZs, we'll not pass a Diamond Tester. Um, like I, like I was just telling you guys, we have three different vans, guys. We got the white gold. We got the gold. And right here on my wrist, this is a two-tone. And what separates the gold from the two-tone, I know they almost look identical. Almost. They pretty close. But if you take a look, the two-tone around the bezel is gold. And if you look on the band, this part right here is white gold going all the way around on this watch. So that's a that's a look at the gold one over here. And this is the two-tone over here, guys. So at the end of the day, me personally, I wouldn't use this as an everyday watch. But if you decide to use this as an everyday watch, guys, you have to wind it. And you gonna, when, you, when you're turning it, you're going to hear it. That's like the little sound that you're going to hear to let you know that you're going right with it, guys. So that's a look at the Gen 5s. I've been getting so many requests for this thing on YouTube in the comment section and on Instagram. I didn't want to review my own jewelry like this. I, I'm looking forward to people buying it and actually doing reviews on it and, you know, you know, shout out to everybody. Go y'all y'all you y'all go on YouTube and search drip talk jewelry and see what people think about this jewelry, guys. Uh you got you got JQ Woods got plenty of um reviews on my jewelry. Um you got GSG reviews, guys, old Stevie D over there. Y'all go check them guys out. You got Carter Boy 45, you got Complex 916. Man, y'all go over there. I shouldn't have to I shouldn't have to show my own jewelry. I, I feel like people, and you got um, old, old Mike, old Mikey over there. Mikey, you know, he done did a lot of my um, reviews on some of my jewelry. These guys is buying this stuff, guys, and they are actually doing real life reviews on it. So put in Drip Talk Jewelry. Look at every one of those guys that I just told y'all, man. That way y'all will get a real raw 
uncut because I feel like I wouldn't want to listen to somebody that's doing a review on their stuff because they're not going to keep it 100. I'm keep it 100 with you guys. This jewelry is off the chain. This watch is very, very durable. So, but at the end of the day, pull up, pull up Drip Talk Jewelry on YouTube. Look at those guys that I just mentioned, man. I'm telling you, they giving real life reviews and they going they keeping it a hundred. They keeping it a hundred. If they see something they don't like, they gonna say it. And at the same time, if they see something that they like, they letting you guys know. So I mean, ain't nothing like a real raw, uncut review, guys. So that's my opinion on these Jan fives. I'm showing you guys. Y'all come to a Drip Talk Jewelry. Come purchase with me, guys. These watches are off the chain. Uh, let's get ready to go ahead on and go over the giveaway. Guys, we getting close to 9K. It's going to either be this video or my next video, guys. For the smaller giveaway, I need to see that twice. I need to see a small giveaway and a big giveaway in the comment section. And put Drip Soldier first. Drip Soldier, and this is what up for grabs in the small we got a gemstone pendant. We have a rope chain from GLD. We have a micro tennis chain. We have a spider with rope chain. Guys, we have a stash bullet pendant. We have a large oval ring. And we have an eternal lifetime ring for the small giveaway, guys. Let me know which one you would like to have in the small giveaway for the big giveaway let me know if you would like to win a micro tennis chain from Harlem Bling let me know if you would like to win this five millimeter baguette tennis chain from Harlem Bling let me know if you would like to win this I think this is a 12 12 millimeter Cuba link chain from Lux Ice two-tone um, we have 20 millimeter chain from Midas Bling, Cuban Link chain. And guys, last but not least, we have these watches from Gemstone Guides. Let me know if you'd like to win one of these for the big giveaway. I'm sorry I had to stretch this video out the way I did. I thought it was going to be a little quicker. But I did want to show you guys what these things are hitting for, guys. And I wanted to let y'all know the way that mechanical system work on these watches. So I appreciate everybody for tapping in with me, man. Drip Talk.